everyone welcome back to another video this is your physio girl how are you guys and i know you must be in very stressful conditions because your boards are going on and if you're a science student then i'm here with you to ease off some of your pressure so in today's video i'm going to talk about if you're a science student and you're thinking and wondering what you should choose as your career option and something that you will be putting your hand in for the life and one of the popular choices is of course mbbs everyone's dream but in today's video i'm going to tell you why you can also consider BPT that is bachelor's of physiotherapy as your career option it's a fantastic option and an equally rewarding career so let's quickly dive into the video let's get started so in today's video i'm going to talk about everything and dividing it into six different segments in order for you to get a clear idea about MBBS and BPT so MBBS that is bachelor's of medicine and bachelor's of surgery is a very renowned course and it's for the people who are aspiring to become doctors in future and on the other hand BPT that specializes into specifically physical rehabilitation improving mobility and prevention of the injury these are the two different courses that you can opt for if you are in a science stream both careers are in healthcare but they are very different in terms of education work life balance and working opportunities so let's break it down first up let's talk about the duration an average mbbs course in india last for 5.5 years with one year of internship whereas bpt that's physiotherapy is slightly shorter and that's 4.5 years of the course with half an year that is 6 months of the internship in mbbs you will be studying subjects such as anatomy pharmacology surgery but in great depth and detail whereas in physiotherapy you will be mainly concentrating on the subjects such as exercise therapy biomechanics patient care techniques going in depth with ortho neuro and although you will be having subjects similar to that of mbbs but it won't be in that much depth how it is in mbbs if you are a person who who is if hands on patient centered care excites you then physiotherapy is a great fit for you now let's talk about one of the major chunks when i started working then i came to know the importance of this thing that is called as the work life balance in mbps you have to go through different things there is a completely different work environment and a work life balance mbbs comes through the long hours emergency shifts and a high stress environment whereas physiotherapists to do the hard work as well but they typically have a more predictable schedule making it easier to be having a maintained work life balance plus in physiotherapy if you have patients who are long term patients and then you then it's an incredibly fulfilling thing for you because they will be coming again and again with you and they will be recommending other people to you for the word of mouth and it will be like a huge spread network for you now going on towards one of the important thing that's the cost and competitive exams Now we all know that one of the very most competitive exams in India one of the top most competitive exams and difficult exams in India is NEET and not only NEET UG but NEET PG as well which you have to go through if you clear your MBBS but telling you with my experience with this on growing demand of physiotherapy i am now really seeing that future where bpt courses would be expensive very soon so people who are going through the bpt and still are in the course they can really see an affordable option in bpt right now because the competition is growing really really quick and bpt is scaling really nicely in india so mbbs admission requires you to clear neat which has very high cut off percentiles as well so in order to get admission in a good government college or in a top most uh, college for good reputation college in private or as well as in government you have to go through a high neat cut off while bpt is generally on a more affordable side even for top most colleges of bpt you can go on with your 12th grade marks as well 
So MBBS graduates becomes the general practitioner, surgeons and specialist after doing their bachelor's and post-graduation. But here's the catch. You have to go on with a bachelor's and then the post-graduation to get a good job, to get a job or get at least appointed anywhere. But it's not the same or not the case in with the BPD. Just after you get graduated, you can directly get a job and start working as a physiotherapist in the hospital or in any of the work environments such as sports team, rehabilitation centers, physiotherapy centers or even private practice. So why you should consider BPT? Here are a few reasons for you. Number one, this is a field which is a specialized field. It has more specification into a physical rehabilitation and all of those things where you will be personally connected with the patient and going on with the protocols and working personally with them. Number two, you can start earning sooner than an MBBS graduate. Number three, it offers a balanced lifestyle and the chance to make real impact on patients' life. Talking something which personally comes from me is when I'm able to work personally with the with my patients and I am uh, I am able to see deeply into their lives, their sufferings and what they are going through. Um, having osteoarthritis and pain in the knee or the lower back but also for the patients who have spinal surgery or they have spinal fractures and they are paralyzed you are able to see them very personally on a, a connected manner and you become one of their empathetic partners where you are able to um, where you are able to be their therapist, their being able to be connected with the patient on a different level. I love seeing that every day progress with my eyes on the patient and it really motivates me on a daily basis. That really motivates me and that is something where I know that my calling was right for physiotherapy and for opting physiotherapy. I just want to add a little of what my personal experience was when I was in 12th standard and I had to decide should I go with MBBS or BPT. First of all, the need cutoff was very high and I was not able to get a good desired government college for MBBS. And for the private, the fees was like huge lakhs. That was in 2016. It was for 40,000, 45,000. Sorry, not thousands. We are talking in lakhs. 40 lakhs, 45 lakhs. So that was a huge chunk being a middle class and that was not really possible and also the returns are very late when you turn into your 35 37 or 40s even so that time you start earning good amount uh, whereas when i um saw bpt as a career option i was more confident in it because uh, first of all it's a lesser duration course second i can start working right after graduating and i know that i can earn good amount because i put in the hard work and the smart work as well one thing that really concerned me was the money the salary that you earn and uh, after getting into this um, so after having a talk with one of the physiotherapists, I came to know that you can have different sources of earning as well in BPT. In MBBS, you get a huge amount. And again, it depends if you are in a big hospital and if you have a lot of experience and a good specialization, you are able to earn a big amount of money. But whereas in BPT, I came to know that you have multiple different options to earn. You can do a pri private practice, you can work in a clinic, in a hospital, become a professor and you can do all of these things at once. Um, I can actually be a professor, go a visiting on the hospital and also can have one or two patients for my private, um, private practice as well. Or I can have have a clinic where I have many different patients who are coming up to my clinic so I have these different options which even a MBBS uh, does and yeah this this is a this is how you earn and it all depends upon you whether how much you want to earn and what career options uh, or possibilities for earning you are grabbing what opportunities you are grabbing the sources of money are in my hand when I can earn from different places then I was confident that I would be able to earn good amount in BPT and that I did when I was in India and here as well. Both MBBS and BPT are an incredible option if you're in a science stream and it all depends upon the right choice depending upon your calling or your interest. If you're interested more into patient care, more into rehabilitation, sports, patient care, rehabilitation with great work and life balance, then you can go directly into physiotherapy. And if your calling is into medicine, surgery and um, something revolving around it, then you can go on with MBBS. It's all upon your interest and what your calling is from. 
but both of these are the good options that you can think about if you're in your 12th stream and still not yet decided what you should go on with. So what do you think? Just let me know in the comment section and I hope this video was helpful to you. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel and meet you guys in the next video. Bye!